And if we if, if, if we skipped over that, our apologies. I think I mean that's uh, you know I, I I tend to believe that knowledge is power, which I've heard a couple <laughs> times. Um, you know and that. That, that, that's the building block of all this. I mean, when we reverse engineer back from, from, from what Juan and Seth and I have been talking about, about where we want the kids to be as adults, what we want them to do in their projects while in school, where we want them to go to college, where they do, if you reverse engineer that back, there, there's, the basics, there's a basic knowledge set we need to give them to be able to then have the platform to then go off and do all these things in a relevant, meaningful way. If you want to. Yeah, uh, everything that we do is not at the expense of, of uh, uh, rigorous curriculum w within our schools. I think it's part and parcel. It's uh, we want kids to read. It's what is it that we're using? Uh, what are the tools that we're using so we can do both? And so it's never at the expense of, of the other. And, and, and just to, to add, I think the um, part of the challenge for at least a school like mine that started in sixth grade originally is that you're trying to fill tremendous deficits when kids walk in the door academically. And we have to think about civics as graduated release. We have to release things slowly and intentionally and purposefully over a long period of time. And my, my lesson about we the people in sixth grade for kids who couldn't read was that it didn't work. It didn't sink in and they were calling him Congressman Kennedy not because they were ill-intentioned but that because they just couldn't yet process that content. So it's about when you sequence it and how you build your scope and sequence as an educator that's going to have the maximum impact. Our 11th grade U.S. History AP course is rigorous. They're not messing around, and they're going to know their stuff by the time they're leaving democracy prep. They didn't know that in sixth grade, and, and that sequence is what's gotten them there. 